三十四條咧，繼續都係問變異，佢就問翻 A、B、C、D 邊一個因素啦，係對於變異嘅貢獻係最少嘅。其實呢條題目最關鍵嘅呢，我哋就要知道返。其實所有變異呢，其實佢哋好大嘅程度都係依賴於我哋嘅基因嘅，所以其實 A 同埋 C 呢，佢哋都係一個基因嘅因素、啊、父母親佢哋本身高定矮，呢、这個係嗰啲拖 g 或者 short g 啦，而 C 呢，就係、是、染色體嘅獨立分配，都係屬於咧基因嘅因素嚟嘅。而第二個關鍵嘅 concept 呢，就係、是、有關於正常分佈咁其實一個正常分佈點解會有好似一個 bell shape 呢一啲呢？其實啦係建基於環境嘅因素。咁所以 B 同 D 呢兩個都係環境因素。不過喺光同埋氧氣之間，邊一個最能夠影響到一棵植物嘅成長啊？而咁多位同學仔，你留意喎，你係一棵植物嚟嘅喎。咁啊，光同氧氣邊個對你緊要啲啊？咁梗係光緊要啲啦。所以啦，邊個對你嘅影響最少啊？自不然就係氧氣啦。我、哦、冇氧氣會死嘅喎，梁 Sir。有光俾你晒下太阳，有水吸下，你自己都做到光合作用，整氧气啦。你仲愁咩啫 ？Question thirty four is about variation. So which of the following factor contribute least to the variation shown? So in this question, there are three critical concepts. First one, all variation are largely dependent on genetic factor. Therefore, we need to divide the answer into two groups. Options A and C, they are the genetic factor. They play a key role for the variation. The gene from the parent cells and the independent assortment of chromosomes during the gamete formation, they are the key factor. And for the environmental factor, including the light intensity and the oxygen concentration. And the second critical concept, the normal distribution of two traits reflect the influence of environmental factor. So we can see two bell-shaped normal distribution for the short and tall plant. So they are the environmental factors, light intensity and the oxygen level. So imagine that you are a plant. So, which of the factor, light intensity and the oxygen concentration, will be the key factor to affect your growth? It should be the light intensity, right? So that's why for the answer, it should be the oxygen concentration. So the contribution is the least. So you may ask, oxygen is crucial, Mister Leung, but I can tell you. Once the plant receives the light and undergo photosynthesis, so they can produce oxygen by themselves. So oxygen concentration, no big deal.